thin and hydrogen test. First, we want to start out with our athlete washing their hands thoroughly with soap and water. We do this to ensure that all excess dirt and oil has been removed from the skin. We now want the athlete to dry their hands thoroughly to remove all liquid. After the liquid has been removed, we want to rub each fingertip and palm with rubbing alcohol. The purpose of this is to make sure that all the perspiration has been removed from the hand. After this, we want our athlete to wait 5 to 30 minutes to allow the hand to completely dry and to allow the normal sweating process to begin. After this, we want to take the athlete's hand and place it on the bond paper. We want to make sure that the fingertips have solid contact for 15 seconds. During this allotted time, we want to outline the hand in pencil so that we know where the fingerprints are when we do the test. After 15 seconds have passed, the athlete can now remove their hand. They are now done with the test. We now want to take the bond paper and spray it with an hydrant. After it has been sprayed with an hydrant, we want to wait 24 hours to, for it to completely dry and react. CC will now discuss the possible test results with the class.